Mr. Umesh Naik is from Kaza Naik, yeah, one right. of the prominent printers in Panjim. Printers and stationery no, shops. We have, we have stopped it now. Long yeah. Twenty years we are not printing now. Tell us, tell me the history of your press. Press actually we started in somewhere in 1940, 40, 45. Japan? No, sorry, before, 40, before my father. Father. 38, 38, 39. Kaza Naik. Kaza Naik. Same place, same location. Same location. Near the municipal garden, just without yeah, that yeah, locality. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. What is the lane called? This is Ruva Travesh the Revula Song. Travesh the Revula Song, what is it? It means Travesh the Revula Song means there was some revolution must have taken correct, place there. Correct, yeah. No, no, no. They are talking about, I think, 1910 revolution or something in Portugal, maybe, huh? if I'm not mistaken. It could be, I don't bare, know. Bare, sorry, you yeah. say your story. We, we started in 1939 here. I see. And in 1939, we had a setback in the Second World War time. And we had, we had a commitment for printing and we could not but somehow we have completed that we got the support from the local local paper supplier also. Set back for paper supply? Paper post was uh, this. Gone up? Uh, yeah. Gone Coming up. from where? I think it is, it, it is imported I think it is that is what I, I feel. I was not born then. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So after, after that um, we stopped. That we had one um, um, uh, neighbor in our uh, village who got the lottery and he got the lottery and uh, he wanted to buy a press and we wanted to sell a press. Nice story. So, so they started, uh, we gave them the press in our premises okay. till the time he makes an alternate arrangement somewhere. And he had, na he had named the print printing the typography Boa Sort. Boa Sort. Because of the lottery. Because of the lottery, you could buy it. Boa sort means good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Okay. Oh gosh, what a story. Who was the owner of it then? Who Mr. Was the uh, Mr. Rego. Rego. From which village this is? Santa Cruz. Santa Cruz. And his brother also had a press near near the near the church. Which one? Um, uh, you know, Silim Khan's shop yeah. next to next to that. Called what? Uh, some name I don't know the name, but he is also Rego. His brother. So he got the lottery, he bought four press, then simply he shifted to near Sheri Punjab and he continued till his death. Naik Bab, that time there were a lot of small presses in Panjim, which yes. are the ones you remember? See, uh, famous press in Panjim was Sadanan printing press. He was working, he was working in um, government printing press and his brother was running a press in the Jesuit house. On the ground. Floor. Called what? Called? Sadhanan printing. Sadhanan. Yeah. Typography Sadhanan. But that time Jesuit house was not multi story, no? No, no, it was ground plus one. Ah, sorry? Ground plus one. Ground plus one. Mm -hmm. So that was typography Sadhanan. Yeah, typography Sadhanan. And you know, he was very, he, he had the insight of the printing industry. Really? industry. Because you know, now for example, we there is a major. Yeah, column of Pikas and all that. Uh, Pikas, no, column, column of 10, 10, 10 M's. 10 M's, yeah. M's, M's. Okay, so um, so that 10 M's, what do we do? We put the layers of 8, 8 M and then one space and to make it 10. Yeah. Or 8 M cut, let be cut and put. So 8 M column you get. Correct. But he was not doing like that. He was making a fixed column. Perfect. 12, 12, 12 columns and his all leads are cut to that size. Wow. So the job would not shift okay. when it locked and okay. so was getting a good locking locking system. Printing in those days was very tough but they were perfect at their job. The yeah. results is to get are better than what people get on computers ah, today, right? No, that is hand composed. Also. Yeah, but good work. Yeah, good work means they were, they were fast. Even I, when I, I had a printing press, I used to read a, read a case. You, you should you know to read the keys. Keys means box was there. And A, S, D, F, A, B, X, all these are the It's not alphabetical. Keys. No, it's not it, typewriter. It is not typewriter keys. It is different. It's different layout. Yeah, yeah. And capitals are on the top and the lowers are on the list. Then all those things are there. Which year you first came into printing? I came into printing somewhere in 74, 73, 74. I have seen you many, many, many times at your shop. But if Bate had not to introduce us today, I would have never, I would have never known that uh, you were from Kaza Naik. Mm. So who were the other printers? Sadanand, I've heard a lot. Boa Sort, I've read their books. Mm. So I've more, earlier it was all pedal operated yeah. presses, which were which were very very common. Then Jedi Pandandis and Sadanand, they they got and Jack Sequeras were the agent for the motor. I see. 
they introduced the machine with the motorized motorized this thing. Okay. This was before liberation, before sixty one. Be, eh, before sixty one. Before uh, somewhere in fifty five or fifty six, you know, during that time. That time. Electric, J D. J D. Fernandez was small, na no, that time. No, J D. Fernandez was had a press. Yeah. And uh, J D. Fernandez bought the first automatic machines. Okay. And uh, according to me, he was not that big, great a printer. Yeah. But he was a very lucky one. I see. He was a very lucky one. And. Uh, After liberation, uh, post office got the instruction they should change the telephone, telegraph forms and other forms into Indian language. English, English, In- English, not yeah. Portuguese. Yeah. And they they disband all the old this thing. Yeah. So that time he he got the advantage of the automation. Okay. And here, then subsequently he started printing the lottery. Lottery, Provedoria. Provedoria. That also because nobody else could compete with him. Okay. And he had the imported machine. Then uh, he started printing electricity bills. Okay. That also. And since you have a capacity, the, the capacity utilization was market yeah. was created by that. Yeah. Uh, this Singbal also was a prominent printer in Singbal those days. Singbal also. Lot of printers came from that area, Church Square, uh, no, Santomi. Pen, Penjim was very small. Pen, Santomi, there was no printing press. Patra hal le thode. Poi popular was there. The Arjunoit was there. The popular father yeah. was working with us in our press. Okay. He started subsequently. That is Kortu was there. He, sta- he started post, um, um, I think, fifties. Okay. Fifty-five or something, fifty-fifty-five, and he had only two machines. You know, it was, was not. But they they had own two brothers were compositor, printer, binder, all, all in one. They had manpower. Lot many printers came from these two villages of Santa Cruz mm-hmm. and Mercedes. Kidak monan, kidak. Kaise zarar the? There was one big printing press here for Bragasa and Company. Where? Uh, near opposite Garden. They were one of the big, big, big time. Uh, really? Uh, yeah. You know, near football ground, Santa Cruz, there is one one bungalow is there. You can see. Yeah. Yellow. That is there. And my uncle was their gen- general manager. I uncle. see. And uh, they were doing arms, ammunition. Uh, then they were also uh, doing fish, fishing rods, fishing nets, all the, all that. And they had two three offices were there, Margaon, Panji, and all. So they were they were they were one time one time one of the big this. Thing. Books were being printed in Goa in those days. Books, I don't think so because there was no no much no demand and sale and oh, uh, this one, URL, URL, yeah, papers, no, papers, papers were, were under printing. There is a belief that the Portuguese censorship were very strong and Sogles and Munta that mm. even wedding invites had to be censored. Is that true? Censor, you know, see what happened. When Portuguese came here, they had put certain conditions under the Inquisitions yeah. that there should not be marriage in the Portuguese Portuguese ruled area. If at all they had, then they were getting they were getting uh, uh, married outside the Hindu, island, Hindu. outside uh, outside the island. Yeah. And uh, other day I was speaking to uh, Mr. Bemre here. Yeah. Then. Uh, he, he has a good knowledge about yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, I asked him, uh, "Is it true?" So and so. Yes, it was true. Yeah. So then uh, he also told me this. Aum Sahib, Pulthudi, Boyka. This song, song was because of there was a vacuum created here. Cultural vacuum was created here. Because even yeah. even Christians, Hindus also, they did yeah. not like the way way these Europeans Europeans mm. were behaving, mm. and because of the, how to express that, yeah. without knowing, without they knowing that they are being, they are being criticized, and yeah. yet you could you could invoke the local. Yeah. Okay. To Actually, no. See, there's only about a 16th, 17th century, but I'm talking about the 20th. When Salazar came into power, no, that that you know, so what happened? That he had he had uh, put certain restrictions on the press also. Oh, Salazar, there was there was a restriction on press. Like what? Like you couldn't you cannot oppose Salazar. Yeah. And they had but this, printing permissions and censorship and all. They, they have they will censor no if somebody yeah. writes about about. Especially in the press. Yeah. In yeah. the press. In the press. But regular invites and all that. I don't think they will. You know they will see under the disguise of criticizing. Yeah. You can do anything. You, you can do anything. That is it. Yeah. Which are the other presses you remember? I remember 
सी में ब्रागा सोफ एंड कंपनी ऑल्सो हैड प्रेसिस दे वेर दे हैड प्रिंटिंग प्रेस एंड दैट वाज द बल्क यू वाज सिंस यू वाज द बिगेस्ट गोमिश इज द ऑफशूट ऑफ दैट गोमिश देयर इज वन प्रिंटिंग प्रेस इन सांता में आई सी मार्कुस गोमिश आई सी इज फादर वाज वर्किंग फॉर दिस इन नावेल का स्टेशनरी शॉप ही वाज वर्किंग फॉर ब्रागा Ours, you can call it a offshoot of uh, this because my uncle was working, I see. Uh, working there. Big investment in those days to run a press, no? Means people did not have have the money one. Yeah. And other one was Dantish, who was also very famous. F. D. Dantish from uh, uh, Saligao. Ah, uh, Sali. Not Saligao. Uh, from Bostara. No, no. I'm so. Uh, I was going to say that only. Ranjal, Ranjal. Ranjal, Ranjal. Ranjal. So not Dantish. Ranjal. Dantish is here. Goa Dantes today. Is there. Ranjal, Ranjal was was the oldest. Very big, yeah. Yeah, and he was he came books from Bombay, Bombay, Bombay. Yeah. Books also, they had books. They used to, mm-hmm. they used to. Be. Mm-hmm. Portuguese, Portuguese. Mm-hmm. You all had a problem to shift over from Portuguese to English. Me? Yeah, mm-hmm. your your press. No, we were doing both both the things. We were doing both. Yeah, yeah, Portuguese as well as English, but uh, English was not that much Portuguese. Correct. Portuguese was, 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 was English was nothing. No, English the readers were readers very few. You know. See, this was ruled by Portuguese. Correct. How did English came here? Because of the expats. Huh? Because of the expats and also officers who came here after sixty one. No. No. British rule. British ruled area. Official language Portuguese. Why English should develop here? Is that correct? What I have read from tits and bits. Yeah. And I was I had always problem in inquiry into that why. Yeah. Then I got that in seventeen nineties. Yeah, troops. Tipu, British Tipu, troops. Tipu, Tipu Sultan. Yeah, British he troops. told uh, French people. He sent his emissary to yeah. French people, and he said we would drive away Britishers permanently from here, hmm. provided you help. And this was news was uh, was um, leaked to them yeah, to the British. British, and they had sent station their troops. They they had, no they had sent one um, uh, uh, this um, uh, uh, sea uh, naval naval yeah. naval unit. But they didn't know where, where where to house them in 1790s because you know we'll, there was no enough um, um, labor or manpower developed yeah. here to cater for their needs. Yeah. So that is how in Bardis the English speaking classes started. Yeah. Okay. And from there mm. they got the jobs. They stationed. They were here for about yeah. nine to ten years. Yeah. And after after ten years, when the threat perception was over, they they thought that there is no point in st- staying here, yeah. so uh, they moved at this thing basis. And at that time, ports were under development, yeah. so this ma- train manpower was here. They have shifted them on the ports. Yeah. Yeah. Some they were t- taken to Burma, and some and uh, uh, railways also. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Then railway was started all right within the planning stage, and then. Um, Most of the this thing went to East Kenyan, uh, British Africa. True. And after British Africa, yeah. they got they got the opportunity to show their uh, metal, especially Salika and and all go on go on go on there. And then the um, uh, it is a secured job. Yeah. They they taught their children English also. How have you seen printing changing over the years in your time only? No, they, if, if you see, if, uh, it is the. Um, uh, electronic media has changed the total thing. They have put the all printing presses out of this thing. You are in house also. You can you can print. Yeah. You don't you don't need a printing press. Yeah. Most most of the printing press at this time they are all all closed. True. Because it is no more a economical proposition. True. And and the volume is a game today. So yeah. Tell us about your genealogy interest. Genealogy interest. I started uh, doing um, uh, printing for the reason of historical research. Yeah. And Father Theo was insisting that I read the proof. <laughs> <laughs> so 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 that you no, know, he has got lesser burden. He has got better things to do. So I started taking interest in reading this thing and um, correcting okay. and okay. gave him gave him the second proof. So he was quite comfortable and uh, schedule was uh, as per the as per his requirement. When I What chart was there and then all those things I should, I should give it in, in time. So he was very comfortable with it. And then I developed a habit of for reading this all this historical. I see. Historical. I see. And that make me and see, since I was born and brought up in a joint Hindu family, we have we have 
where I was staying with my uncle. We had about 50, 60 people in the house. My God, this is uh, Santa Cruz. Or? No, no, this is Marcai. Marcai. Yeah, Marcai. You know, there, you know, every auntie, uncle, they always come to Naranya. This Naranya, no, that uh, that uncle. So, 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 that is how they used to tell us. To, uh, <laughs> <laughs> this is this. Is, yeah, yeah, this yeah. This is yeah, how yeah. we took the interest in genealogy. Right. Yeah, very interesting. Yeah, I have read certain genealogy. There is a county family. They have got a full genealogy. Yeah. Yeah, which is recorded county. from 13th century or onwards. Really? Yeah. 13th century. Yeah. Well, well, ninety or something. Wow! And if you see the resource they have contributed to the country, forget about everything else. Yeah. You know, many engineers, Delhi. many doctors, Delhi. many. This, there are lots of people they they have contributed. I see. I got a copy of. They are they are based in which from which area? Priyal. 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 Mm. Priyal. Countess. Yeah, countess. All these Alcons. Alcons. In, in Portuguese time, time count or C O U N T O. They are Nike County. Nike County. Yeah. Very See, and, and what happens now? For example, the, 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 suppose there is one more night. Yeah. I am also night. But our Gul Devat is Nagesh. Yeah. From the temple of Nagesh, all are there. They are we are very close. So you are Dai Ji, Dai Ji, all of you. Dai Ji. If not directly related. No, yeah, yeah. We are from the same. same and today place. DNA is showing the connections also. There are yeah, some Anglo-Indians who find their connections. Yeah. Now, for example, what Mr. Souza wrote book he has written. Sorry. Mr. Souza. Richard Disuza? No, not no. Richard. Can you discuss the book? Can you? My teacher, Bhavan Dhamma, where is it? My Bhavan Disuza book. The last Prabhu. Last Prabhu. The last Prabhu book. Book. What? Yeah, Bernard. Bernard Disuza. Bernard Disuza. Correct. 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 Correct when they were they were they were to be converted they ran away from here and all their fields were lying idle yeah. and they had no job so some of them got together and asked them what is the rationale in keeping fields like this yeah. and and converting us at the age of 60s and 70s okay. when our prime age is gone and there was a compromise they struck that we don't mind converting our children to <laughs> catechism yeah but Um, yeah. You should not allow force us to uh, join uh, this religion. So by that compromise, uh, they have allowed their field to be this thing. And the last problem is the, the disorder yeah. what is what yeah. the writing. And the, from that on, the, all yeah. children became the Christians. Yeah. So, but when it comes to uh, finding the genealogy of mm. Goan Hindus, mm. what is the best way to go about it? One is temple. Temple records are there. Temple records are there. Temple records means see we have got the Gotras. Yeah. We have we are coming from Correct. certain rishis. Correct. Clans. Yeah. So I am I am my Gotra is Kaushik. Yeah. And Kaushik Gotras oh, all Nag Mandora is there. Oh, our family. Then Naik County is there. Naik Gaunekar is there. Then. These are all in Bandora. In Bandora. Sardesa Sardesa Sardesa. Yeah. Prabhu Pratap Rao Sardesa. Yeah. All, all, all. You, if I, I can know immediately from where family. Which this family. is oral history, or the records are also maintained in the temple. Temple record means there is nobody else to record okay. the temple. If somebody wants to find, they can. Okay. They can by they asking can. around, and yeah, yeah. that is common knowledge. See, now I, I will tell you. In 1650, a person born by name Rama Kamathi. He was uh, with the. He was the advisor for East India Company. I see. And he was uh, working in close this with the uh, governor of Bombay. And there was a false uh, um, case. Ki- case fabricated against him yeah. with false witnesses, and he was he was put into the this thing, and his property was attached, and everything everything was everything was sold. Okay. See, then after that. British government accepted that it was it was wrong thing and they they were declared yeah. him that it was he was the all fabricated thing. Yeah. And Shane Goembab has written. A, uh, he was asked such a big go on why why somebody should not write whether you are pre- prepared to take this uh, challenge. He said yes. So he was even prepared to go to London to get some records and all all those. Mm. But uh, he did not go because the Asiatic Society of Bombay and Calcutta. I see. He could get the whatever uh, records the records needed, and he has written a beautiful article. If yeah. I ask somebody, nobody knows about it. Yeah. 
as this made this book published by um, uh, kokni bhasha mandal yeah and price is only 200 rupees but he, they have written about he has written about abe faria he has written about rama kamathi hmm. he has written about wali patan wali patan uh, port and he has written about uh, uh, reconquer of goa by afas uh, 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 dalute being so much in the printing publishing line you feel that goans we have a sense of history or we have lost it over the years or we had it or what जय मुन आपकी देन आई रीड समथिंग यू नो द टाइप ऑफ ए के प्रियोडकर चटियार डिसूजा वो आर डेडिकेटेड आई बिलीव द ए के प्रियोडकर ऑन ए हाफ टर्म ऑफ ही वाज ही वाज डूइंग द रिसर्च 50% ऑफ ऑफ द दिस थिंग ही टू स्पेंड फॉर डूइंग दैट एंड 50% ही वाज यू नो दिस सॉर्ट ऑफ द हार्ड वर्क दे बिकॉज़ दे हैड सो मच लव फॉर द हिस्ट्री Hello. No, no. Yeah. There is such a love for the history. And I know one of my, my uncle who had gone to study engineering in, uh, in Portugal. He told me, you know, when I had Portugal, I I could not afford. Yeah, he had gone on scholarship. Yeah. Could not afford. I he was giving uh, tuitions. I see. Of the, of maps. I see. Yeah, and he was this thing, and he got married. He had one child. He left them behind, and he went to Portugal. Completed. I see. His, yeah, completed I see. his engineering. And came here after seven or eight years. My God, not easy. Means it is it was still dedicated. They okay. they had they had. You know, now today even if you get a free, nobody wants to take it. <laughs> We must thank Bati for 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 introducing me to Mr. Naik. Otherwise, I would have never known. Mm. I met you many times in your shops. I've asked you for diaries, and you told me no. We treated each other as a client and a mm. and a mm. and a patron relationship. Mm. Thank you so much, Mr. Naik. One last thing, your number, WhatsApp number. Nine eight two two one two six three three five. Six three three five. Thank you, thank you so and, uh, much. My hobby is come after closing the shop. Come really, here. really. <laughs> come here. Yeah, why? Sunday, Sunday I come. Really. Then on Sunday I read uh, Panorama. I read here. I see. Yeah. We we need a place. We need a place to sit down and talk. Cafe Prakash used to be our unofficial.